Wait, how did you get there? Is that just a straight path right here? Yeah, it's just here. I didn't have to dig or anything. Oh, I got a saddle. There's pumpkin seeds, flesh, and a saddle in this one. That's all that was in this. All right. You, you, the other one was better. I think okay. I we say go ahead and go back up so we put all this stuff up. In a... Ooh. Hmm. Okay, so what I'm going to do. You can go up if you want. I'm just going to... <laughs> this is a Minecraft mogus moment. Okay, this is officially the best Minecraft episode. <laughs> Whichever episode this ends up being. This is going to be uh, 10 or 11. This is the best one, just because I got jump scared by Minecraft. Disappointing, but approved. <laughs> it's funny. Because <laughs> that was a very, very genuine reaction. <laughs> I wasn't expecting it. Yeah, I know you aren't. <laughs> oh, yeah. I I wasn't expecting it either. <laughs> oh my goodness gracious. This is mad annoying. We're gonna put a door right there, I don't care. <clears throat> this sucks, my guy. <laughs> you are absolutely tickled to the bone. <sighs> Best Minecraft moment of all time? Question mark, question mark, question mark. He said it. I think that was officially the best Minecraft moment of all time. Mojang. Mojang stamped it. <laughs> Mo Mojang himself. Did you get rid of the furnace right here? Yeah, I moved it downstairs. Okay. Um, because that's where the other ones were. Yeah. Oh, that's where it was. <laughs> oh, I... I didn't see them earlier. I messed it up. Where did we go? Oh, we came from here. Okay, that's good to know. Okay, um... Someone got in trouble. Or they just forgot how the buttons work again. On the cop car? Yeah. <laughs> That's happened. I believe it. Oh, son of a... Hey. Son of a fish pill. Did you see my Mario was red pilled video I sent you? Yeah. I thought that video was funny. Yeah. You didn't have to, but I thought it was funny. Who was the person who did that? Was that Solid JJ? I don't know. I didn't. I don't know people. I think that was Solid. JJ. But it was a solid video. Uh huh. Oh. I'm just gonna dump all this in here. I just broke my game. It'll be alright. This video is gonna break the internet. No, like, there's, for anyone questioning why this looks or is the way it is, it's just like that. No, yeah, this is Minecraft's fault entirely. Like, our game is like slow and laggy and it keeps getting blurry on the screen. That's not Pierre's fault. Well, is it every other Every other video <laughs> on two white guys is Pierre's fault, but this one? <laughs> This is, this is, is it Minecraft's fault, or is it Nintendo Switch's fault? Or both? Moja, or, uh, Microsoft. True. Mi Microsoft did this to us. You are playing a dangerous game. Exhibit A. <laughs> I'm just watching your screen. Okay, I'll take a little nap. Do you know the song that's playing right now on the bell? I wonder how many videos these bells are in. Video number four has a song that you won't believe. 
Oh shoot! Remember how you were saying Cat Quest Two is a really fun game? Yeah. It just went on sale for four bucks. Just now? Yeah. Like, it was like fifteen dollars earlier. Yeah, eleven minutes ago. <laughs> All right. Do you know Deku Deals? No. It's a website where it's like essentially a better version of the Switch eShop wishlist, and it sends you emails whenever like stuff goes on sale, but not just on the eShop and like real stores too. Oh okay. And uh, that's pretty cool. Cat Quest Two, seventy five percent off. But for three seventy four, lowest price ever. Is is today the time? I might just go ahead and buy it, and we can play the Cat Quest series on White Guys. Eventually. Yeah. At one point. Yeah. There's a lot of eventually and at one point on two White Guys. <laughs> that we always forget about. <laughs> but if you have the game, well, obviously we'll see it. Yeah, we'll be scrolling through and be like, "Is it time?" Uh, do you have any more of this wood? I don't know. I'm okay. asleep. <laughs> okay, that's fine. Ugh. Okay. We'll do it like this. What the? Broken? Erm, um, what the scallop? I always do this whenever I find a, uh... I want to put a torch right there, torch right there, torch right there. A mob spawner? I always do this. Where's my door? There. Oh, you, like, lead to the mob spawner? Yeah. I always do this. How do you break those without breaking it? What? Mob spawners. You don't? Okay. There's a very small chance you'll pick it up if you have a silk touch pickaxe. But it's, like, not worth breaking. Well, it can be if you could pick it up, but it's Brother, well, why well, you, you pick it up manually crafting those. Because I don't know how. I keep dropping stuff out of my inventory and throwing it on the floor, so I just gave up. Okay. Oh. How do you not manually craft those? This is the worst spot I could stand in. <laughs> I don't think there's a worse spot I could have picked. The night's gonna be over by the time you <laughs> I finish this. Where's I need more blocks. See look, you go down by one block and the black tent is over your screen. Ooh. We take those. It could just be a mineshaft edition. Minecraft mineshaft edition. I don't think it's mine shafts, I just think it's you go down to a certain depth level. Oh you think? It could be that it's like hard to breathe or something, so your vision goes black. I don't know. I don't know why they would change that. It's I just... think it's from like the deep, like whatever update. From like the stuff all around me. Yeah. All of this. Like, go up by one block. Okay. Let me. Oh. The only block I didn't want to break. <laughs> oh. Ooh. We go. We go. Ugh. Like it's a certain depth level. Stuff becomes really freaking dark. That's not cool. That's, That's not cool. No <laughs> good. There's a spider down there. Nah, that's not good. We'll just walk past it. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Dermacraft. A series where I play Minecraft. As Germa. I don't know the full copy pasta. Oh, it's a copy pasta. It's not even real. Like, he played Minecraft once and then never again. He called it a series. He's a true white guy. <laughs> I can attest. Germa, if you're listening to this. For some reason. Be on our channel. <laughs> The video will come out in like five years, but please be on our channel. <laughs> Great. Now if something happens to Germa, now oh, wait, I have to get a, rid of this episode too. It was too. a ten-part series. Oh. Okay, here's the copy pasta. Oh, so you're just not a true fan. I guess not. 
Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to episode 1 of Germacraft, the series where I play Minecraft. This is going to be a single player let's play, and when I say let's play, I use that term pretty loosely because I am an idiot in this game. You're going to see lots of fails, you're going to see lots of triumphs, at least I'm hoping. So grab yourself a nice hot cup of coffee, hot cup of cocoa, i got an apple cider right here, freshly brewed. Let me take a sip. Ah, that's some good cider. And that's it? Yeah. That's the start of the Minecraft? Yeah. All right, so episode one. Hey, I'm what's on the... this? Hello? Hogging? Hey, yo? Hey, yo? I'm trying to mine around it so I don't, like, let it fall in lava or something. But yeah. I just keep finding more. Three? We can make, like... Something. Nice. Okay, I'm actually gonna... Hmm, I don't want to drop that. So oh, according, I have a chest. I'm gonna put it in the chest. According to the Germa lore wiki, Germa creates a, a world with the seed Diamonds are forever lol cheese burka. As you're talking about diamond, Or as... Yeah, yeah that, as I was literally... The words were about to come out of my mouth that he makes a world called uh, Diamonds are forever. You found diamond. Forever. And, <laughs> and this small detail has already condemned this video to okay, be one of the greatest videos on YouTube ever. I think the German lore wiki is a, a bit biased. I think this Enderman's a bit biased. Oh no. You see him? I don't want you to see him. <laughs> if you were a pumpkin, he can't see me. Do you have a pumpkin? No. Okay. You, you, we found those pumpkin seeds. Yeah, we did. <gasps> did you see him? Yes. My man zooped. A mile. <laughs> <laughs> just keep building, just keep building. He's still right there! Don't look directly at him! <laughs> He's like, what are you, nothing over here, don't pay attention. <laughs> I'm just trying to place my stairs! <laughs> I just want to put my... Oh, he's dying. This is so tense. I think I think I want to take my chances. Oh my gosh. I think I want to take my chances. Dylan, do not. I have an apple. What's that going to do? I'm going to kill him. Dylan! Wait. Oh, he's gone. I'm starting to put it. Do you hear this? I'm watching you play. <laughs> Is that a new YouTube, like, kind of thing? You play? <clears throat> oh, it's me play. Okay, I get it. <gasps> Where'd he go? I killed him. Did you actually? Yeah, I, I killed him in like three hits. That was like the there's biggest I, waste. There's uh, coal, coal over there. That's like the biggest waste of a golden apple I've ever used in my life. Is that why you gasped? Because there's coal? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay, but it made you happy, because that I was safe. Oh, it's so bright up there. Look at all that coal. Look right there. Look at all that coal, fella. <laughs> okay, Germa. Okay. Talk more stuff about, like, diamonds or something. Germa's... Oh, the second thing I was about to say was... Germa's first death came in a record timing of 35 seconds after the world was generated. And you almost died. I think the Germa lore wiki is dictating how this episode goes. We'll read more. Okay. First episode of Germacraft is entitled Broke. The episode is by far the most famous one among Germa's audience. Most of them will probably nickname this episode as Germacraft itself. Grandpa, Basically you earlier. Grandpa period, episodes 9 through 10. Grandpa on period. In a grand final attempt to finish the series and achieve the objective he'd set out for himself, he broke out the grandpa carrier character and went into creative mode for a last burst. What does that mean? It sounds like a Final Fantasy move. A last burst of craps and giggles, even. I think this makes it easier to get to the mineshaft, too. 
But it doesn't say craps. It is Germa. What the? Oh. Oh, this isn't going to be enough, bro. I think I'll just have to finish it with ladders. Are you making a staircase directly to... It's uh, pretty close. Once I get there, if I don't make it, I'll just eventually do ladders. But for now, once I get up here, I'm just going to build up and leave. I think this is really funny. <clears throat> How close are we to, like... Wait, would it be perfect? And then it's going to be a stair. <gasps> And then a stair! Oh my goodness! Oh no! <laughs> we'll figure it out. For now, I have to get inside. I left the diamond. <laughs> it worked! <laughs> <laughs> it's meant to be. We have to use that staircase now. Fine. Wait, I'm, I'm gonna come up here and put all my stuff down. What are you mad? It's an affront to my architecture, <laughs> but it's funny, so I'm going with it. He didn't like it with your architecture. <laughs> it really is a front to your architecture. Because I'm the pinnacle of interior design, as we're both aware. I've seen the episodes. <laughs> More than any man should have to. That's actually facts. I have watched two white guys more than... Hang on a second. You're our biggest fan. You see what's in my inventory? I had just enough. That's perfect. Nice. We're gonna figure out what to do with these. It's raining, it's thunder. I hope it's thunder, unless they're lightning creepers. Close it. Run. Leave. <laughs> we built this city. Uh, are you trying to sleep? Okay, I'll come. It's sleep times. Get in bed. You haven't slept for a while, actually. You might spawn one of those monsters that kills you when you haven't slept for a while. It's you know, okay. I haven't been outside. Do you know what I'm talking about? I'm a Redditor. I haven't been out. Oh. Yes. oh. I think this is our chest organization. I juked him. <laughs> and by juked him, <clears throat> I mean... <clears throat> <laughs> you juked him, alright. <laughs> Gotta love Minecraft, baby. Wait, well, you didn't actually blow anything up, so it's fine. Minecraft babies are horrible. Like baby zombies and stuff. Ugh. Don't gross me out like that ever again on the channel. What? Minecraft babies. <laughs> this is the new Minecraft spinoff. Ugh. It's like, you know how they have like like baby Looney Tunes and stuff? Ugh. <laughs> baby <laughs> Minecraft. <clears throat> quit saying uh. I get the reference, but quit saying uh. Is it a reference? It's a reference. I wasn't making a reference on purpose. You know what the reference is. No. If you know what the reference is, then wait. Sh shame on you. What am I referencing? Don't worry about it. <laughs> I'm gonna kill that cow. What am I saying? Part two. I'm gonna kill the freaking heck out of that cow. The freaking oh, heck, oh. dude. We gotta censor that. I censor freaking heck, but not what Rebecca said. <laughs> Shout out Hollow Knight episode one, I think. Uh, one. It's, Wait, no, it was two. It's the one where we hit it the microphone. It was Hollow Knight episode two, because on episode one, I, uh, I didn't fight Gra's mother. Okay, so this doesn't want to grow at all. We're just going to get rid of everything. We built this city. Were you, were you singing that earlier? I've been singing it this entire recording. Okay, because I was thinking, why is that in my head? I 
I get the reference. It's the Stardew Valley fishing noise. You don't get the reference? <clears throat> I'd be shocked if you did. It's it's Friday Night Funkin'. I hate you. What? Because that's the reference. <laughs> I know it's the reference. Well, do you know what song? No, I don't like Friday Night Funkin'. I know. I don't think it's bad by any means. I just don't care about it because... Yeah. I don't have any kind of attachment. I think the songs are good. There's good music. What's your favorite song? I don't know. Okay. I don't know any of the songs. But you play them all the time. You know I've heard them. <laughs> I, I know there's good songs. Like, I can tell they're good and I appreciate them. But as a Friday Night Funkin' fan, that's not me. Okay. That's a perfectly reasonable response. It's hard to be a fan of something when you haven't, like, played it or watched any content of it. Yeah. Unless you're just a sheep follower. In that case, stay on the channel. <laughs> we, need, we need you watching. Thanks for the money. That's all you are to me. We love our fan community. You know, to a certain extent, that really is all they are to us. We don't know them. Because we don't know them. We don't have any connection with them. The only connection is that they give us views, likes, and money. We'll know them in the future. But, like, us right now? We're not even they? recording this for money, so the purpose isn't for money. But the fans that we would know... We don't even know if we're going to get money. I just That's mean, the funniest part. I just mean that white guys, like... We're never going to have, like, fan connections. Oh, yeah. I think with our formatting and scheduling, it's impossible. <clears throat> Can we shout out, like, the first actual person we don't know who, like, comments on a video or something? Oh, absolutely. We, we'll make a whole video about it. It can be, like, a two-minute video or something, but it's going to be, like... Like a Saturday upload. Yeah. Like, shout out Scrimblo Bimblo. Yeah. Um, for being the first person that we do not know who they are to comment. And they commented on our blank video of season one. And by then we'll be in, like, season four, and they'll probably have stopped watching. <clears throat> but what if that's how we built... There's a trident. What if that's how we built fan connections? Because we shouted them out, then upload that video... Like, not long after. Well, I think it would be funnier if we did <laughs> wait that long. I say we wait however long it is, but that would be like one... Is that an Undercity? What is that? Or is that just a bunch of seaweed? It's right next to the house. It's not even a joke. <laughs> well, oh, it's green. Look. Yeah. See it? I think it's just green. It's still cool. No, it's awesome, though. It's white god. Bro, what is that? Is that a zombie? <clears throat> oh heck no. Hey, that's my hole. Or no, it's not. I had a hole. I actually had my own mind somewhere. Cole. Cole. Sprouse. <laughs> the guy. Didn't he do something? Did he? One of the Sprouse brothers did something really We're weird. not shouting out Cole. <laughs> Sadly enough... No, oh, no, 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 no! It's not hypocritical to say this. It's just realistic. Sadly enough, when it comes to people oh, like crap. that, who've done Disney, who have been a part of Disney, and they're... I didn't get hit by the explosion. For once. Good job, Christian. Most Disney stars who are, like, young or whatever, they have a terrible career in life afterwards. Yeah. Do you know how they got kicked off the show? Oh, crap. There's a witch. <clears throat> I think they take, like, four hits with a sword. You're fine. I don't feel like dealing with it. I say as I'm about to, like, go back down. Yeah, just deal with it. She's not strong. Why are you going all the way over there? Just mind the call. She ain't gonna bother you. Bothers you. Um, yeah. Do you know how the, the Cole kids actually 
aren't on the show like Sweet Life anymore or like anything like that? Mm-hmm. You do? Yeah. Why is that? I don't know. I, I was assuming you were going to tell me. <clears throat> oh, I just asked if you knew and then you said yeah. So the reason why is they had all these big plans and ideas for the show and thought it could be a big show and it'd be cool and whatever, like to continue, like they had a bunch of ideas. Uh, it won't kill you, it's just half a heart. And then the producers were like, no, there's a limit on how long we let shows run. And they basically just like kicked them out. That's a little did you know. Hmm. Yeah, they wanted to continue like the show and the series and no, the producer people just said they weren't allowed to. Also, it's like, I feel like a lot of child actors in general just don't really get... They go down terrible paths. Yeah. And that's what I was going to say, is that most people who are in these situations, as like child actors, have not terrible lives necessarily, but... A good few of them can have terrible lives. Hannah Montana. Miley Cyrus, yeah. Well, I was... Yeah, okay. I was referencing the show, but... Yeah, you're right. It is Miley Cyrus who had that. I forget what all, like, she did. Or, like, if she even did anything that was, like, bad. Wrecking Ball. That was controversial at the time. That was her? Miley Cyrus? I came in like a wrecking ball? Yeah. Yeah. Oh. I didn't even realize that was Miley Cyrus. That's, like, one of the main reasons why she got big again and why people started, like, bashing her making fun of her. Yeah, she did, uh... You know people didn't like that song very much. But people love the song. It's it's one of those weird things. Well, I think of Miley Cyrus, I think of Hannah Montana and Party in the USA. So you have that pure view of Hannah Montana. Like, I also I have that think, like, one. didn't she, like, quote-unquote, go off the deep end? Yeah, that's why she was, like... I don't know if she was wholly or halfway naked in her Wrecking Ball video. Oh. There were some clothing things. I don't understand why uh, <clears throat> some of my plants and crops do not have, like, brown water. Why are they not watered? There's water directly underneath them. And the proof of it is that this one is watered, but this one isn't. It doesn't make any sense to me. You have fun, bud. Time of my life. Child actors depress me. Ah! I just think about them and I think about the terrible situations and the the bad everything and I just get sad. Yeah. Wait, how do you make, uh, do you know how to make it? Make what? Uh, these. Dude, fences have always been one of the most confusing Minecraft things to me. I think you should come to bed. But I don't want him to step on my crop. True. Okay, that's good enough. <laughs> I don't have any more wood. Honey, please come to bed. That's your cup, that's your, uh, tea kettle cuphead voice. That's like the same exact voice you used. Is it? Yeah. For, uh, Elder Kettle? Yeah, Elder Kettle. Teacup man. <laughs> Hello, Cuphead and Mugman, my dear boys. Cuphead and Mugman! <laughs> oh! <laughs> Welcome back to Cuphead and Mugman. Welcome back to Cuphead! From the hit game, Cuphead. Oh. Speaking of... Well, Cuphead and is a pal mug man, and they like to roll the dice. Roll the dice. By chance they came on Elle's game, and gosh, they paid that price. That price. And now they're fighting for their lives. Life. But it's fun with dread. Dread. And should they succeed, but not succeed, the devil take their heads. Heads. The de- <laughs> The de- <laughs> You having fun? The de- The devil. <laughs> When he can't take their heads. So, no. I, <laughs> I knew that's where you were going, but I didn't want to say it. 
I didn't want to acknowledge it. Uh, what do you think about our farm? Hold on, I'm... I'm gonna right. make it bigger, but... For now, I think that's fine. I thought you were gonna Minecraft dance emote on it. No, I can. You can put those around it instead if you want. I don't care. I just want something to be around it fence-wise. Yeah, I, that, that's that just matter. the kind of wood that I had. <clears throat> Um, I wasn't going to do a full circle at the opening where the crafting table is. I was just going to leave it. Yeah. Like. That's going to be like. But, and you can hop over. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was going to pick up the crafting table. I think. But that's how far I wanted it out. Was that far. You might just want to leave the crafting table probably. I was just going to move it like closer to the crops or in a different section. You could set the crafting table on top of the fence thing. You use this to hop on the fence? Yeah, that's why I had it spaced out like that. It needs to be like three blocks. I think it's three. I'll just drop my fences and uh, let you build it. <clears throat> let you be the fence mastermind. Now I have the Fairly Odd Parents theme song in my head. Why? I don't know. Just the parents, fairly odd parents. They got them wands and wings and hey. floaty crowny things. No, I don't know any of that. I just know that one part. That's all I'm thinking about. Yeah, that's it. No, not that far. That's too far. You eat it. Yeah, that's about right. <coughs> that's the weird guy. I went to a like a Hank Hill voice. I got them fairly odd parents. <laughs> No, Bobby, I don't want you around them parents. They're fairly odd, you hear? I've never watched King of the Hill. I've only watched it for the clout. That's the only reason you should ever watch anything. You know, I don't actually remember watching any King of the Hill. I don't hate this. I think this is okay. Yeah, but a little bit. <laughs> That's cute. Did you run out of fence? No. Okay. That's not the whole thing. It's gonna be like more out. Oh, uh, okay. Let the Stardew player. <laughs> Let the uh, true, <laughs> true, 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 true. <laughs> Let the Stardew player map out the, the, whatever you want to call Apologies it. Apologies for questioning you, my liege. Oh, I messed up. His Highness the Stardew player. Excuse me, I played Farm Farmville whenever I was a child for years. Oh, my bad. Okay, I'm more than just some Stardew player. I am Farmville player number 765,000. And you better. On the dot. Give me the clout and respect to deserve. I kind of want to just place it next to it. But for what I'm going to do... Do we can't do that. So yes. This is gonna work, I think. I think I'm smart. I think I'm good at the game. Oh. For this episode of Minecraft, we're going back to our roots. Already? It's been like ten episodes. Over like the span of six. It's like months. it's like how do we have roots? Where well, at this point, we've, we're an established channel in white guy time. You're right. Like, you got to think about it, not in real world time, but in white guy time. Like, in white guy time, we've at least got, like, 60 subscribers. We're going to pass your channel. Unless your channel blows up. I hope it doesn't. Like, real talk. Like, I hope I just stay this, like, small guy forever. Like, your channel doesn't blow up. Yeah, like I thought a, you were saying you hope white guys doesn't pass it. No, no, no. I don't care about white guys, <laughs> like how big it gets. Yeah, but I think that if white guys got really big, it would be funny because people are like, oh, play this game. But like, there's no way of like accommodating them because they're years in advance. Yeah, they're already gone and done. Yeah, they'll and then it's gonna be the 
we're gonna get like a comment like we'll play this game and then we're gonna read it and go yeah i think we play that around like 2025 i think they'll wait four years <laughs> right 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 right. and i think that makes it even better yeah but like with my personal channel i hope like i don't grow past like maybe a couple thousand subscribers just because i think having a small channel there's no, like, expectations for you to be a certain way or do a certain thing. There's no, like, I don't have to be, like, super consistent with my uploads. Stuff like that. Well, it's also, do you have to be that anyway if you're a big channel? I don't think so, I mean, but there's more, of a, there's more of an expectation for you to do that if you're a big channel. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, it's not that you have to be. It's just, I like, agree. that pressure's there. And I think that's why I would be great to have a big channel. Because you want that sort of consistency? No, because I don't care. Mm -hmm. they'll, be, they'll be like, upload a new video, we're going to unsubscribe, and I'll say, okay, bye. <laughs> right. Because I'm not trying to have a big channel. My goal isn't to have a big channel. My goal is to make one person in the world happy, I, just eventually. Right. Like, at least, I just want one person to be able to smile. My mentality because of Pierre is, video. I make a video that I like, and if someone else likes it, that's cool. I just want to make the world a better place. Then stop playing League. I'm cleansing League. <laughs> Don't worry, I can fix him. I was about to say, well, that's an I can fix her mentality. <laughs> no, it's... If people are going to play League and they're going to do whatever, I want them to at least be able to look at some content and laugh about it. I don't know. Even if people don't like my League content or find it funny, that's the reason why I want to be a spread out dude. Like, I want to be fully spread out and everywhere. I want to upload Castle Crashers. I want to upload League. I want to upload Ibn Ob. Like, I just, I want to be everywhere. Right. I don't have, like, a goal. We're like, oh, I'm a league YouTuber. Oh, I'm this, that, and the other. Not to exactly say why I'm valid and correct, but the only two videos I have are Pokemon card openings and League of Legends. Don't forget Yonky Splunky. I wouldn't really call that a video. I do categorize it as something on my channel, but I don't know if I categorize <laughs> shorts as videos. That's fair enough. To me, a video is something that I sat down and took time and effort into making. I didn't even make that <laughs> controversial white guy moment. I uh, I think a short can be a video. It just depends on like if your intent in making it. Like I have videos on my channel that are shorts that weren't made as shorts. Like they became shorts retroactively. Yeah, but Which that was kinda kind of made without irritating. the intention of even being a short. Yeah. You didn't even want that to be a short when you made it. You just wanted to show me a funny video. Yeah. And I was like, yeah, that's pretty funny. I think other you, people would find it too. And you were like, can I put it on my channel? And I was like, yeah. Non-consensually. It was consensually. I am that guy by not being that guy. <laughs> <clears throat> I don't know. Even if... All I do is make one person like a video. That's good enough. Mm -hmm. I've already made Nathan happy. He says my videos were entertaining. Dude, even like... I want it to be a stranger, someone I don't know, but I still count Nathan's love as, you know. Nathan showed his family the video where I looked at his playing card collection, and he said uh, his brother left two comments on the video, and I count that as a stranger. Like, yeah. in my book. Because a stranger it's... who liked the video. I know this is going to sound a little dumb because we're comparing this to Nathan. But if you think about this not in a Nathan perspective, like how we know him and as another YouTuber, mm -hmm. that's the reason why you feature people. What do you mean? Like, like that's why you feature people on your channel. Because and you so people them. from their channel will come over and leave comments and like on your video. And your people will go over to their channel and leave comments and likes on their video. Yeah. See, I like... But Nathan doesn't have a channel, so it doesn't really work. But you get what I'm saying. I like featuring people on stuff, not because it's like a cross-promotion or anything, but just because I like doing things with other people. Like, it's 
things are always more fun when you do them with someone else. I didn't mean like you don't do it because it's fun. Like I'm I'm not saying it's not fun. I'm saying mm-hmm. like that's the reason why it's like you put featuring whoever. Oh, true, true, true. Like you put opening my friend's playing cards. Right? Yeah. So all of your friend like Nathan, who was your friend in that video, everyone who's his friend will be like, Oh, Nathan's in this video or like his family or someone. Right. If that makes any sense. I get what you mean. That that's what I mean. It's not like an actual thing, but you put featuring whoever because you're getting the attention of their fans. Right. And that person is probably like, well, I want my name to be on your channel. And that's why people go, hey, can you say featuring me or can you include me in the in the description yeah, of the thumbnail just, or something? I'm not they a want huge fan of like transactional cross promotion. Yeah. That's not it doesn't make it transactional. Like this is transactional, me and you, you and I doing white guys and talking about it. Mm-hmm. But it's for fun. Right. So like white guys is just for fun that you and I do together. But it's also transactional because I have a YouTube channel and you have a YouTube channel. Right. And if you just if you just look at it from a perspective of you and I using each other for views or whatever, I mean white guys work, so like it makes sense. Yeah, and it's like if White Guys surpasses one of us, then we can use that to like boost our channel. Right. See, so it's 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 not the reason. There's a why there's a we... level of like transactionality that's completely unavoidable. Yeah. Like it's just inherent with the field, but at the same time, I don't want like the intent to be transactional. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's it's transactional regardless of the intent. Right. And I think that is what makes it okay. To be how you are. Like, I remember a certain YouTuber saying that, like, he was like, I get all these, like, emails, like, hey, want to collab on a video? And it's like, yeah, but, like, I know by me being on your channel, I'll, like, boost your numbers just because my name. But, like, you're not going to boost my numbers because of your name. So what what does that get for me? I, and I can't help but think, that's such a, like, lame way of looking at things. Like, if somebody's, like, want to do something together, then... As long as they're not, like, a butthole, then why not at least try? I think it... I think there is a reason for it. Because you were talking about crumbling to expectations earlier. Mm -hmm. And I think that's one of the main reasons why that reaction would be there. Yeah. Like, I'm not saying I don't get it. Because it's like, if you just don't want to do something, then you don't want to do something. But, like, if that's your mentality where it's like, I don't want to do something just because I don't get anything out of it... I think that's the wrong mentality to have. I think... Mm, I, I don't think it's necessarily wrong to have that mentality. But I think that's just... Because you don't like that mentality. I think... But if, I don't think it's inherently wrong in any means. Because some people do this. I think more so if YouTube is your like your job, then that mentality yeah, is more okay to people, have. People are doing this... For a living. Like, this is why they make YouTube videos, is for a living. Right. So it's like, why would I spend my resources and my time instead of working for myself and my money to help you right. if I don't get anything? Like, if, if you're working at the li- like It's like if you're working at the library downstairs, mm-hmm. what do you get from helping the person at reference? If you're working circulation, why do you help the person in reference? You don't get anything from it. Why would you do extra work whenever you... I think that's different because it's your job. Well, I was... That's what I'm saying. It's this person's job. No, like... This is Ms. what Gale they do. would get onto us if we didn't help. But in a sense, by recording and collabing with this guy, your fans are getting onto you because you haven't uploaded a video where you did this instead of the new thing. I, I get what you're saying. You, you know how fans get pissed if you, like are uploading Minecraft, like PewDiePie stopped uploading Minecraft and everyone got mad at him because he stopped uploading it and they liked it. And he had to make People a video. People just vi- get he, mad at PewDiePie he just because he's PewDiePie. He had to make a video being all like, look, I just don't feel like playing Minecraft right now. But that's how it goes. Is If you have enough subscribers to do it for a living, mm-hmm. then there are def- you're going to have to deal with stuff like that. There's a certain level of pandering to the audience that becomes unavoidable. Almost. Because if we get big, we are going to not pander to the audience whatsoever. If we get big, we anyway. can't pander to the audience. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> like, there's no way we do that. But 
I don't know. And I think, I think that's part of the beauty of this channel. I think there is a certain value in understanding that something should be transactional depending on situations. Yeah. Like, uh... Like business first. Well, in a... I think we're looking at this fully differently because I'm looking at this from an Eminem perspective. Like, let's say a rapper dissed Eminem in a song. Mm -hmm. And then Eminem replied to that diss. He would just be giving whoever that is clout. Right. Who I, Like, him responding... Right, because it's Eminem. Yeah. Him responding gets them a bunch of stuff. I got this turtle stuck in the trench. But them dissing Eminem does not give Eminem any more followers or clout. True. So what's the point in Eminem responding if all it's going to do is give this dude that has beef with him more money and followers or whatever? So why would Eminem even want to battle this dude or respond to it? Okay, yeah. And I think that's the perspective I'm looking at it as when, we're, think... when we're talking about this channel situation. I don't really have that, like, transactional perspective just because, like, I'm not in that position to where something would, like, take away time from me doing my job because this isn't my job. Yeah. Like, if you look at my collabs playlist, you'll see just, like, random whatever. I think when you're just purely doing it for fun and have no plans on, like, making it big, even if the Pierre channel blows up, that's never going to be my job. My oh, job yeah. is my job is going to be computer scientist and you know cybersecurity or programming or debugging whatever I decide to do with that. Yeah, I completely agree with that. Like even, even if, if my channel ends up making me money, I'm not going to make it my career. Yeah. Like that's that's not what I feel like called to do. That's not my purpose in life. Unless there is some specific very very specific like this is definitely what you should do. Unless I experience that, I'm not even, you know, I'm not even bothering. Right. I think YouTube has, YouTube is like one of the most unstable careers, I think. So I like, hope statistically. all of you white guy fans don't get your hopes up because, well, actually, that might be a reason for people to get their hopes up for us. We're recording white guys because we like it and it's fun and not because it's our job and we have to do it. Right. And I think that gives us a certain level. But it makes it to where, like, we're, we won't burn out on white guys as fast as we would if we were doing this as, like, grinding up for our job. If you if you have this feeling of work attached to something... Why does he have a piece of chicken? <laughs> oh, that's not a chicken. It's a... Uh, it, oh, I forgot the name of it. This thing. Nautilus shell? Is that what that is? Ooh. Nautilus shell. That's a League of Legends character. No, I was having fun! <laughs> no! <gasps> I'm gonna die. You're gonna kill me. The bit wasn't worth it. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> this is not worth it. You changed back to Alex. <laughs> Not when I'm trying to build in the water, my guy. This is definitely a Dylan just unplugged the Wii moment. <laughs> but we're not going to just... I don't know. There's a certain sacrifice you make. Whenever you're um, just putting out videos because it's your job. Yeah. It's like, uh, this is going to sound weird, and I don't even know if I should say this, but I'm going to say it anyway. Say it, brother. It's like being in a relationship and doing promiscuous activities. Okay. Like, with your partner and stuff, like, whatever. It's, okay. um, it's, if you always put out and you don't actually want it, it's going to be... Not really. You know, you're going to find it harder and harder to put out and have that stuff be enjoyable. Okay. And that's kind of like, I'm staring at this baby turtle. I'm sorry. <laughs> I just, I can't stop looking. He's so small. Oh my gosh, he is. Like, actually. Look how tiny. But, um. Did you see me in the background? I do. Sand? 
I don't even have a goal. I just think it's fun. That's what I was doing with the farm. I don't even... I was just wanting to do it. But... If you were hoping we were beating the Ender Dragon too bad, I'm hitting sand. It'll happen one day. <laughs> In like 2034. That's fine. Hey, can't you make melons like really good? I just don't remember how to do it. I don't know if glistening melons are edible or not. I know they're for potions. Anyway, if you're doing stuff Ooh. for other people or for a, <laughs> for a goal that you are not interested in, it gets hard to do it. If you're not sitting here passionate about making Minecraft videos... Me sleeping soundly after a hard day of punching sand. You're not gonna, <laughs> you're not gonna enjoy Minecraft videos anymore if you hate Minecraft. But you know your fans want Minecraft, so you keep uploading it and making it. Right. That's why, like... And that's the whole that's the whole spiel I'm going for. The more you put out for when you don't want to, the more miserable you are. That's why, remember uh, that CEO assigner Twitter account that I was telling you about? How I used to run that? Um, <laughs> yes. Are you still recording? I am. I'm just going to change some things real quick. Minor, just because it, it wasn't fun anymore. It felt like a chore. The Twitter thing? Yeah. That was even before I, like, deleted all of my Twitter accounts in general. Like, I just I just didn't want to do it anymore. It just wasn't fun. It stopped being fun. Look at the model, and look at the way, like, the feet move. <laughs> Yo? She looks like she's trying to hit a gritty, but she can't. I think I want to go back to the mine shaft. Okay, I'm going to keep digging. But yeah, that's why I stopped being the CEO assigner, just because uh, I my heart wasn't in it anymore. For the, like, half a year that I did it, it was one of the most fun things I had done to that point. But, like, it stopped being fun. Like, I just didn't have a drive for it anymore. So I, like, made that big, long thread about how I was quitting and stuff. Also, if you if you knew the CEO assigner and, like, that thread and all that, I apologize. I, I did promise I would never say it was me, but oops, I lied. I mean, you've already revealed it in, like, episode 5. Yeah. Was that in Minecraft 2? <clears throat> no. It was, like, one of the first videos we made on the channel. Yeah, but, like, in that thread I said I kept my promise to, like, never reveal who I was. I think I only told one person on that Twitter account who and I now was. Now you're telling hundreds of thousands. Hey, look, another spawner. Uh-oh. It's, like, directly next to the other one. But, yeah. I tried to make a, like, video talking about how I used to be, like, Twitter gimmick account owners, but, like, not only could I not remember all the gimmick accounts that I ran, because <laughs> uh, there was, like, several. Yeah, you just have so much clout, you don't really know how to categorize it all. But, like, eventually I just, like, I got weirdly, like, sentimental in a way that it was, like, Sentimental and philosophical. And I was like, I don't want to put this out right now. I'll come back to it later and re-record. I don't know. I have conflicting feelings about my time on Twitter. Every now and then I'll think... Uh, Twitter does just kind of suck. Every now and then I'll think it would be nice to have a Twitter account. Just so I can like no news when it happens and like uh but that's why you watch omni and arlo and be in contact with uh yeah but like omni and arlo don't cover everything like uh Shh, you're a fake fan <laughs> no it's like i get what you're saying you're yeah right. and uh it's different doing it i yourself. could there are certain like content creators and like people that i would like want to say things to when they only, like, use Twitter. Like, they don't use Instagram or, like... Uh, and, like, certain people that I've, like, tried to message on Newgrounds that have Newgrounds, they haven't gotten back. We're just going to assume they haven't gotten back to you because of Twitter, not because, <laughs> not because they just don't want to talk to you. Which, you know, it's not a big deal. But I, oh, I feel is. like if they would have... If I would have tweeted at them, they probably would have responded. You cannot ignore my dude MH4 and think you're getting away with it. <laughs> I will hunt you down like the 
dummy that you are. But steal your clout from you. <laughs> underneath your britches. <laughs> Not the britches. The britches clout. <laughs> Only fans? Not the bockers. <laughs> Sorry. I'm kind of funny sometimes. No, I, I said sorry to editing Dylan. I know. Because you're going to be listening back to this and it's going to be a laugh jump scare. For some reason, you're going to laugh. And you're going to... Ooh, gonna, look at that. Minecraft PNG. What you're going to do is this is going to be the pipeline. You're going to hear the laugh jump scare. You're going to get ticked off. You're going to send a, a very strongly worded text to me about the laugh jump scare. And then you're going to go back and continue listening to the recording and then realize I talked about it more and then get even more mad. Can I ruin your imagery? Sure. I think the last episode, I'm just going to make it like an hour long Minecraft upload. No, like, it's not going to be like, you're still going to go back and listen to it. But if I didn't say anything inappropriate or wrong, which I've been making sure we haven't. If we say something that needs to be blurred or edited out, I'm writing it down. I did say booty hole. I, I think that was <laughs> fine. I'm going to leave that in. You're so brave. As controversial as that, as that might be, I'm leaving that one in. I don't know. Any, um, I think I'm just going to make that one upload. This? Like, just an hour long, two hour long Minecraft episode. Like, I probably want like an hour long and then an hour long episode. Like, the only reason I would do that is because we don't make progress. Yeah. And it's kind of. I'd say we've made decent progress. Yes, but would you say going to the mines and then punching sand is going to be six videos worth of progress? I think at this point, the people expect no progress. I just kind of want it. Like, I just... It's up to you. You're the one who edits the videos. I'm thinking about our editing and uploading schedule. And I, I just want that more. Because it, um... It's not for the people. It's for me. Right. Because I'm... White Christmas wasn't ruined, necessarily. But there's a Minecraft video uploaded for half the days of White Christmas. You see where I'm going with this? And whose fault was that? No, it's that <laughs> if we keep making Minecraft episodes and then splitting them up like how we are, we're never going to have any time to upload anything else. Right. Oh, yeah, I see what you mean. So if we I, have one long Minecraft video, we can still upload. Because what's going to happen is we're going to, if we if this turns into like eight or nine Minecraft episodes, it's going to be Minecraft episode 10. Right, because we're not in a situation... Unless you wanted to, like, start doing two a week and, like, upload two Minecraft episodes in that week. It would be, like, Minecraft Spelunky, Minecraft Mario Party, Minecraft Cuphead, Minecraft Mario Party, Minecraft Cuphead, Minecraft Spelunky again, Minecraft. And that's just how it would go. Because we already have two series. We have mm -hmm. Minecraft and we have Cuphead. Look at the beautiful landscape. It looks nicer than where I'm at right now. You you understand. Yeah. It's How long very... have we been recording for? This recording is seven and a half minutes long. Oh, when did you restart it? When you were talking, when you were saying the name of your Twitter account, and I told you I was going to restart it because I wanted to change something. The FPS was bugging, and it was stuck at 30. Oh, okay. So I, like, reset the recording and changed the FPS. How long have we been how long have we been playing Minecraft for? That recording was that's twenty seven minutes. This is an hour and forty five minutes. So we've been playing for about two hours. Alright. Like I'll probably end up making that a one hour episode of Minecraft and then making this another hour episode of Minecraft. And then however long we record after that. Because seven minutes plus forty five minutes, that's close enough to an hour. Yeah. So it'll probably be two two episodes of Minecraft is what we have so far. I'm just about ready to stop playing Minecraft if you are. Okay. Let's like put stuff up first. Yeah. It's just it really sucks whenever we only upload once a week and then I have um 
15 right. episodes of Minecraft to upload. I mainly wanted then that, to... Uh, and that means it takes like five months of us just uploading Minecraft to get those 15 episodes right. out. I mainly wanted to... Uh, what, where, what am I doing? Talking. I, I, I was moving the wrong way. I mainly wanted to... Uh, play Minecraft just because in white guy time it's been a like hot minute since we've played Minecraft. Yeah, but it's also fun. Yeah, but, like that was the primary reason why. Not even because you enjoy playing Minecraft? No, just because I, th I thought it had been a while. <laughs> this man's like, I only want to do stuff because it's fun. Hey, you know on the channel it's been like eight months? Let's do this again. No, but you know what I mean. <laughs> no, I, I get it. It's just it's just a funny contradiction that we spend an hour talking about how no, we only I, do things because we want no, to. No, I just think it's a series we have, and it's been a while since we've contributed to that series. So I want to contribute to that series. Oh, let's wait until... Oh, we can actually go to bed now. I don't say let's wait till we go to bed, but I think it's a... Hold on. Is it? Oh, it's sunset. Let's go watch the sunset together. Okay. And that'll be the end of the episode. Yeah. Oh, but you can't say that'll be the end of the episode, because then it's all like, ugh. What do you think about the farm? All I have I'm going to fix it, lead. but I'm going to do it like this. I have, like, the log up, the log sideways, and the log up, and I'm going to do that again for that section. So that way the melons will grow here in the middle, and the pumpkins will grow here on the side. And then I'm going to get rid of those beets, and I'm going to... Wait, I dropped my lead. Don't step on my crops. Who do you think you are? Wait. Actually, this works. Thank you, everybody, for watching this episode of Minecraft. Bye-bye.